Hey guys, it's John, and today we are playing The White Chamber. This is a 2005 point-and-click horror game. It's free. There's a download link in the description. I've been getting requests for this for about six years, so I figured I'd better break down and play it. I avoided it for some time, but I'll get into why in a second, because it looks like there's a cutscene happening. I think. Now I feel like I'm just being reverently silent for no reason. Oh. Anime. <sighs> All right. What's going on? Why was I in that coffin? Probably because you were dead like most people found in coffins. So, I put off playing this for like six years or something because I'm not really an anime fan and it looks very anime, but I've heard it's good. And this year, as I've said in previous videos, I'm trying to go back and play stuff I, I missed out on, at least in the beginning. So let's check it out. Um, oh. Uh, look at it. There's a message on the panel. Connection error. Well, that's not good. I can't get it to work. That's too bad. Let's look in the coffin. Was there anything in there? That's the coffin I woke up in. Why was I in there? Uh. It's too heavy to move. The surface is warm. There's a slight vibration. Okay. Um, is there anything else in here? Anything? Wires. Do we just there? I've connected the wires together. Well, that was a that was an easy fix. Now can we use the panel? Do you know where you are? No, I don't. What the hell is going on? I'm in space. I mean, I kind of figured things look like that. Do you regret? Yeah. I don't know. What? What? Do I regret? What? Are you ready? Yes. It looks like there's a way out. Cool. Let's look at the windows. This is definitely space, but I can't see any signs of other ships or anything. I will say, preemptively, it's cool that there's uh, voice acting. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, console. It seems to be some kind of navigation console. It must control the station somehow. That's usually what consoles do, they control something. It doesn't seem to be working at the moment. I'll need to find some way to power it up. All right, so <laughs> here we go. Time to power on the entire I'm station. Sure this controls some sort of cradle system that elevates part of the station. Why do I know that? Because you used to work at the station, probably. It doesn't seem to have any power. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go here. All right, there's a right computer. And a wrong computer. Left computer, sorry. It's a backup unit. Um, can I go look at this? It's kind of dark over there. It's marked as being a droid control console. Cool. It looks like a unit designed to provide backup power to certain systems. I mean, it does say backup power unit on it in big bold letters. Waiting, waiting, error. Oh, I think I found the problem. It's destroyed. <laughs> waiting, and online. Life support is online, that's always good. Um, doesn't look like there's anything else in here. For the time being, maybe we'll go across the hall. All right. So yeah, pretty cool so far. It's fully animated, it's free. Pretty neat. Oh, there's a trail of blood. Here we go, lab coat. Is there a key in the pocket? Lab coat. It looks like there's something in the pocket. Horror tropes. There's a blank ID card and some kind of override key in the pocket. Okay. There we go. So I got an ID card and override key. Let, let me see this. It's an ID card for use in security scanners. Okay, does it say a name on it or anything? This is an override key. I gathered that from the name. Scanner. 
It's an ID card scanner for the gate. Let's let's do it. Let's use it. I can't really do much with it without a DNA sequencer. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, let's put the override key. I think in this backup power unit, probably. Were there keyholes? Key slot, okay. Uh, so we got comms, medical, station rotation. I'd need to find a system this fits. Oh, oh wait. Oh, okay, gotcha. Comms are online. Good, let's take a look at the right computer. It's marked as being a droid control console. Yeah, 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 okay, let's uh, interact with it. Please enter color code sequence to activate droid control software. Red. 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 Red, red, red. That's not right. Red, 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 red is not right. Okay, we'll probably need to find out uh, it's the a sequence for that. Okay, so this is what we just powered on. Unsent message notice. Urgent SOS request. Looks like someone was trying to send out an SOS message, but it wasn't transmitted. The following message failed to send. It could not be sent to an inner system communications grid. It's in all caps, so it sounds like it's shouting. This may be due to a problem with the internal communication system. Please contact your CNC officer, as you may be unable to send the external message until this fault is resolved. What if your CNC officer is dead? Send extraction immediately, we're dying here. I don't know exactly what's going on, but those of us left fear we won't last much longer. Please send help, CNC officer Richard Wiles. And we also got a message from Taryn Michael. According to this, there's a note somewhere to unlock the droid software. Aha! I mean, I figured that out. Did you get the droid I sent you last week? I'm a little worried I didn't pack it tightly enough for the long haul. It came through all right and seems to be working fine. I did have a fright when I loaded the software onto our system and asked for color code. Then I found your note, so it's all good, anime face. I'll send on some of the cool add-ons when they come through. Welding, fire suppression, toast making. Uh, for now, I guess it's just your own little pet to piss off the commander with. Then we got spam. This just looks like promotional spam for some concert. Don't miss your last chance to catch one of the galaxy's hottest stars. Ugh, this is poorly designed. Critics are calling Nicole Ash's new show one of the finest pieces of hollow theater ever witnessed by mankind. Written and directed by her fiance, Lance Bishop, this is a performance you won't want to miss. After a successful 12-month tour, yeah, yeah, yeah. The message is asking for information about a missing ship. Is it this ship? Those to all SF remote outposts and vessels. The science vessel Prometheus is now two weeks overdue. It's scheduled rendezvous, and it has been over three weeks since its computer last check-in with the central SF data center. We are asking if any stations or vessels in the area have had any sight or uh, sighting or contact with the missing craft that might shed some light on what has happened. Okay, well, wait, is that, is that it? Um, yeah, it's just four. Okay, well, I think we're good there. Let's take the key out and put it to medical. Did that, did that do anything? What's over here? It's all dark. Okay, well. Let's see if purple-haired anime protag can uh, get us moving. The, I, I assume since there's a lab coat over here that the medical wing is now open. It didn't work. Looks like this card isn't encoded with an authorized DNA sample. Okay. Well, that's too I bad. Can't... Okay. Well, I drop the ID card, please. Okay, I don't know if we can use medical yet. That thing, though, used to lower the cradle. I wonder if that somehow corresponds with, um... Station rotation? Life support's already online, so we don't need to mess with that. I'm guessing maybe we'll use the medical wing later. Maybe after we get hurt. Maybe there's combat. Wall panel. It doesn't seem to have any power. Okay. 
Okay, use this. Uh, off, on. Oh! What? Activate solar array. We're near the star Irene. Rotate right. Uh... What am I doing? Oh, oh, it's solar powered. We're getting from the star, right, okay. I understand now. We've got power, guys. Let's do this. Safety lock engaged. So we're, so we need to go to the station. We're in the cradle and the docking chamber. Uh, safety lock offline. Lower cradle? Okay, cool. So can we raise the cradle? No turning back. What? I guess we can't raise it. I should have tried. What the hell happened here? An extinguisher. Let's pick that up. Okay, no comments about it. That's fine. A bulky fire extinguisher. That is what it is. Suck. It's just a cupboard. Let's open it up, man. I mean, uh, yeah, strange box. Let's take it. <laughs> Can of drink. Let's take it. Moldy foods. I'm not touching that. Who knows what I might catch? That's true. Ah, that lunchbox seems kind of moldy too. It's a sealed lunchbox. Are those grapes inside? It's a brain, a decomposed brain. Use junk food wrappers. They're covered in dirt. Gross, somebody used to vacuum in there. Uh, this one's bloody, but let's open it. Please. Oh shit, Th that's someone's arm. What the hell is going on here? Well, let's take it and put it in our inventory. <laughs> cool. Uh, we got a, we got video disc number one. It's a standard pre-recorded video disc. Microcosm disc, eh? That's quality for you. I don't know, I, I'm i not familiar with the world, so I guess she was dissing it. We've got, we got a left arm. A human arm. Is it though? Is it? Okay, that seems like, there's a switch here. Can we press it? What? Video screen. It's a console for viewing video discs. Well, we're in luck. Check it out. Uh, this is replacement lab technician Arthur Anderson making my first scheduled report. I've been here a week, and things haven't been as I expected. What'd you expect? They keep me working in the upper lab doing routine sample analysis. It's a waste of my time, but they don't want me to go into the main lab chamber. I told Commander Artemis Trent that I hadn't traveled all this way to do monkey work, but he wasn't interested. Hmm. The work wouldn't be so bad were it not for the tension on board. Everyone is keeping to themselves, but no one wants to talk about you. They're quick to dismiss any talk about what happened to my predecessor, or what it is they're working on down there. One thing I'm sure of is that they really don't want me here. Only Professor Erickson is remotely hospitable towards me. But even she's evasive. At least she's kind to me, though. Something is definitely going on here. They're scared of something. I've heard them calling the main lab the White Chamber. I don't know why, since I'm not allowed in there. Goodwin and Wiles hate going anywhere near it. I've seen Goodwin go in a couple of times when they've needed him, but always briefly and reluctantly. I'll keep investigating, but I don't want to push them too hard. The atmosphere around here is tense enough as it is. Yeah, you've, you've said that. You've reiterated that several times. So, thanks, Arthur Anderson. I can't use these yeah, things yeah, together. I don't want you to... Thank you. Okay, so what do we get out of that? Well, we know why it's called the White Chamber, I guess. What is this? Mirror. So that's me. Not bad, considering... Not bad. Blanket. Ooh, let's take the blanket. A warm looking blanket. Let's take it in case we get cold. Now. Hang on one second.
Is there any... We can save. Um, save. Enter a name for... Your, I haven't had to do this in a while. Uh, cool. Should we go out here? Let's go out the door. Excuse me? <laughs> what? There are real trees, all right. But how is that possible? It's not. It's just some sort of like... I can't make a path through. Atrium? The trees are too dense. I mean, this is where people take their smoke breaks. So wait, are we underground? Surely not, because there's space all around us. Wait, wait, what is this? Shower panel. Wait, this is a shower? This controls the shower and toilet compartment. Wait, is that is that what this is? It's not responding. Well, too bad. Okay, so we got a blanket. We got some items. Dr. Salt. Ah, Dr. Pepper. I'm actually surprised I haven't heard that one before. Um Wait, where'd we come in? Didn't we come in over here? I can't leave. I thought I came in over here. Am I supposed to go out this way? What? Space? What the hell? Where did the beach go? I'm not sure it was ever there, but now there's a door. That, that was weird. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's go in here, I guess. Oh my god. Let's take a look at the tools. A selection of bloody and rusted lab instruments. Oh, if they're rusted, we can't use them, right? They've rusted to the surface. Yeah. I doubt they'd be of much use in that state anyway. Yeah. Let's take a look at the microscope. I recognize this. It's a 7777 Zentradi series proto-analyzer. Freaking nerd. I'd need some kind of sample dish to use with it. Okay, sample dish. Got there it. are some strange chalk marks on the board. Does it mean anything? I don't want to wipe away the chalk markings. I think they mean something. I don't know. What could it what could it mean? Is it like a really sloppy tally mark or Oh, an axe! That sounds good. Let's take that. I got it. I wonder what she's gonna say about it. Is she gonna say it's an axe? It's a sharp axe. This should be useful. Axes are generally useful, yes. Projector system. This looks like an old projector system. I think it's connected to that old video player. Hmm. Okay. I can't get it to do anything on its own. Maybe I should try the video player. Where's the video player? Speaker. It's a speaker. I remember having speakers like this when I was a kid. Okay. It won't do anything without a video cassette. Ah, okay. Can I take the scissors or there's an elevator? Can we go inside? I wonder where this leads. Well, let's find out. It's broken. Looks like the panel's been smashed. There's no voice line for that. Let's go through the vent. It's welded shut so I can't get through. Well, isn't that convenient? Okay, so I got the axe in here. Um, I guess we'll get to ask somebody a question later. Ha ha ha. Nothing else to click on here. We'll go to the seal. It's sealed. The room has been automatically sealed. I think I can see a fire through the door. What? Buh. I can't use these things together. Okay, well, clearly we're supposed to I use that though. Use stop, stop, stop it. Calm down. Cut. Um. So does this just play the same it won't message? Do anything without a video disc. Right, 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 right. Okay, let's go. Let's go back. Excuse me. Creature. What's all that written on the wall? Well, I'm dead. Or not. 
What? <laughs> so now that was real. What happened? Was that even real? What is this place doing to me? Uh, I don't know. Is there something there now? It's not here anymore. Let me check out the console. Yeah, there's nothing here. Okay, um, right. Okay, so, I've got an axe, a blanket, video disc, which I've already used, a left arm, Dr. Salt, steel box. Wait, wait, what's in the steel box? I can't box? open it. I wonder what's inside. Let's use it, let's, let's ask it a question. I Damn, ruined that it looks pun. like it's welded shut. Even the axe can't break a box this strong. Wow. Cool. I can't Stop! Stop. Oh, we left something in here. Video disc. We get to hear that guy talk again, I guess. And a note. What does the note say? It's a note I found. It says, patience while you grill bacon rind. That's rather strange. I wonder what it means. Purple, white, yellow, green, blue, red. Come on, protagonist. Let's go. The people in the comments are fed up with you taking so long with these puzzles. Wait, oh yeah, video disc, number two. Uh, let's use it. Officer Richard Wilds is missing. Professor Erickson woke me up yesterday morning for a meeting in the living room to discuss what had happened. Dr. Goodwin said he was working late into the night. I went looking for Wiles when he realized his medical laser wasn't working. This place is small, so it wasn't long before he realized he wasn't anywhere to be found. He said he woke the commander, and the pair spent the night searching the station to no avail. Even the life pod is still docked. With no answers to this mystery, everyone is reaching breaking point. Even I'm starting to feel just as paranoid and tense as the rest of them. Calm down, Arthur. I think at this point it's becoming just a question of who will snap under the pressure first. I strongly urge you to send a new team here. If these guys don't get away from this place, I fear things are only going to get worse. No one trusts anyone anymore. How much hair gel did you put in your hair? Suspicious of me, as I'm the new arrival. Even Sarah. I mean, Professor Erickson. What? Is growing more wary of talking to me. Sarah, huh? She's been spending more and more of her time down in the White Chamber. I know it's not scientific, but when I look in her eyes, she seems lost somehow. I had a drink with Dr. Goodwin. It's the first time he's really talked to me properly since I arrived. Though what he said made little sense. He's convinced Wiles was taken by the artifact this day. Artifact? Apparently, Wiles wanted them to get rid of it. Dead space. Since my last report, I've overheard mention of the artifact several times. And their opinions on it seem mixed and conflicting. Oh, this all worries me. Again, I urge you, please send a relief crew as soon as possible. I guess if the artifact was a Steam game, it would have mixed reviews. I'm trying my best, guys. I really am. Uh, wait, what was I doing? Oh, right, right, the code. Um, what was it? Purple, white, oh, it's lit up. Hang on, hang on. What's over here? This is the analyzer. This console was used as some kind of analyzer. Yeah, it's called an analyzer, so I figured that out. Human DNA trace detected in system. Safety override activated. Oh, safety override. Oh. There's a panel over here. This is the control for the emergency tank cleansing system. Uh, the tank is empty now. There'd be no point cleaning it. Oh, okay. We can take a shower in there later, I guess. It's a DNA encoder used to store data ooh, on ID ooh, cards. Ooh! 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 Ooh. Looks like this won't work unless I insert a DNA sample first. Right, 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 right. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this. Um, I think I can remember it. Let me see if I can remember it from seeing it once. Purple. White. Yellow. Green. Blue. Red. 
Oh, what's up? What's up? That guy's on fire. What's happening? Oh, this is in that room that's sealed. Uh. Oh my god, you use the. You use the old keyboard arrow keys. I tried doing WASD, nothing happened. Keyboard, wow. Um, oh, okay, open door. Yeah, sure. Uh, enter, space, oh my god. Wait, was that, was that supposed to happen? Wait, how, how does that solve any problems? How can we can go in now? I'm sorry. Wasn't there a dude on it's on a bed fire? It's body-shaped burn marks across it. Probably because someone was on fire. I don't think I could sleep even if I wanted to. I was asking you to sleep. Filing cabinets. It's a filing cabinet. That was weird. I guess the droid's just gone. Envelope. Cool. They're surprisingly sturdy. I doubt I could force them open. Huh? There's. There was surprisingly. Wait, so I just lucked out, and this is the only one that opens? But the handle's broken. Oh, that's why we can open it. Okay. So there's a laser desk. <laughs> laser desk? It's a medical laser. Not working. Could be the power source. We gotta power everything on, don't we? Jeez. So isn't this door just open? No? Lock. Oh, this is medical right here. There's a video disc. Voice controlled panel that operates the quarantine chamber. Neato. It'll only respond to the voice of an authorized doctor. I'll never get this working. The voice of an authorized doctor. Yeah. I can't. Okay. Well, let's see. What did we come in here for exactly? Oh, yeah, we got the envelope. What's in it? There was a video cassette inside. Aha! What is this Silent Hill looking room? What? My body. What? Oh shit. Am I gonna die in here? Why would you think that? What's with the body? A decapitated body. It's crucified upside down. Am I in hell? I don't know. Keep that bloody thing away from me. I'm gonna save the game. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Let's go. There's a traffic light. Was that there before? Wait, is this a looping hallway? Oh! What? Oh, it's freaking out! Wait, was that a mistake? Um... I'm sorry, what? <laughs> what? Oh my god. 
there was an arm trapped in there. It must have been from that guy. Why do we get the feeling this isn't a coincidence? Because this is I a video can't game. The pipe open. Okay, okay, I get it, I get it. We'll use the axe here. Arm. So we got another yeah, arm? This is absolutely insane. Pretty gross. So, oh, everything's normal now. Oh. Oh. Everything's normal now. So we got a left arm and a right arm. So we have two arms. Hmm. What is this? What are those stains on the floor? On the wall, too. They look like blood. Yeah. They sure do. Why don't you touch it? Whatever they are, they feel encrusted into the surface. What happened here? I think somebody may have died. Just a guess. So... What the hell? Right, let's go... Yeah, yeah, video, video cassette. Let's watch it. Maybe we'll learn something. Um... Boom. Let's watch it. What the? That's me. Is it? Laser cutter. I might be able to reach it. I don't know. I was looking for a way to like make the laser cutter work to explain what happened there. Wait, what? Were these here before? They weren't, right? They're the batteries from the video. That was horrible. So stuff from the video is now here. There's a new mark. What? There are some strange chalk marks on the board. Okay. Uh, sample dish. What? Some kind of tissue sample in an airtight dish. There's a label on it. What does it say? What does it say? Tell me what, what does it say? We got the sample dish. Some kind of tissue sample in an airtight Commander dish. Commander Trent. The label says Commander Trent. I hear these things are hard to find. You hear that sample dishes with human tissue are hard to find? I should hope so. Scalpel. A medical scalpel. Where was this stuff before? It wasn't here. We got so many items. Okay, we know we know to do this under the scope. I recognize this. Ooh, the tissue DNA. has been extracted specially to store a clean sample of DNA. Guys. We can ah There's a horrible smell coming from that fridge. I feel sick. Hey, it's like PT. A fridge hanging from the ceiling? It absolutely stinks. I wish I could get rid of it. Uh, I mean, we can cut it. How'd this get here? This chain is holding up that strange fridge. Strange indeed. Let's let's cut it. Where's? Let's ask it a question. Damn that it! I mess up the pun down, again. But it'd smell worse on the floor. I'd rather find a way to dispose of it before cutting it down. Okay. Do we use the switch? Like, go through the trap door? Ah! Uh, what? What the hell is that? That's gross. I don't know where it leads and I don't want to know. That's gross. Let's ax it a question. <laughs> Something's jamming it. Ah, more body parts. Torso. Is it? It's an entire torso we're taking. What? It's a full human torso. Even I'm surprised I can carry this. Okay, you don't need to 
freaking condescend to us, all right? We understand the concept of unlimited inventory. This is something that's been bothering me. Can I take this mirror? Because I didn't try to do it earlier. Wait, what's going on up here? And I guess I did take it. Huh? A shiny mirror. Okay, what is going on here? Open up. What? Hair. Is that? Oh, come on. Don't tell me that's hair in there. It's a head. Honestly, don't know. Is the head in our inventory? It is. A severed head. The eyes have been ripped out. Yeah, it's also opening and closing them. And shooting uh, X-Men Cyclops laser beams out of them. What the heck? Okay, so we got a head, we got a torso, we got two arms. Where are the legs? Where are the legs at? We got a scalpel. All right, we got to sequence the, the DNA. Uh, put it on the ID card so we can go into this other room finally, right? Where? Oh yeah, it's this analyzer. Okay, okay. Uh, let's do it. Shut up. Wait. Is it this? Yeah, we use it on the sequencer. Done. Now I just need to put in the card to be programmed. Finally, we're using up some of these freaking items. I've got so many. I hate this part in these type of games where you like you just have tons that and tons of items. Okay, so, I can now go into this room, and I don't know what we'll find. Okay, it's all powered up now, too. Let's use it. Yeah, we did it. Explosive? Canister of high explosive. Okay, let's take it. Where, where did we put it? The thing's half the size of you. It's a retro video gaming magazine. Oh no, here's where we're self-referential. What the heck is this? Oh, is this supposed to be like Nintendo Power? I'm not gonna read all this, but you can pause it if you're interested. Maybe this is like some of their previous games? I don't know. It seems like it's very retro focused. It said the MES, which is obviously the NES. A screen, okay. A screen attached to that old console. I can't make out the image. Wait, that's a, that's an NES right there. An MES? It's a really old video gaming console. Let's uh let's let's use it. I don't really have time to play games. Oh. I don't know what that's like. Freezer. I can't get in while the door's closed. Um. Okay. Is there anything else? I don't want to. Those old games are really stupid. They just go on and on until you die or throw the pad at the wall. Um. Okay. I think they're fun, though. I guess I can have a quick look. What harm can it do? Are you serious? What the hell is going on? Don't tell me this is inside the game. Oh, we are supposed to- <gasps> The door is closed. We open it inside the game and it opens in real life, I bet. Cannot carry any more items. What? Oh my god, we gotta do something with this. They are explosives. They look dangerous. I like the little pixelated, uh... I so, wait, wait, what does it say? I can't see the handle, it's too pixelated. Oh, pixel hunting. I gotcha. I can't... It's the freezer door. I mean... I can't make out the buttons to switch it off. Okay. The MES console I'm playing. 
So this is like the video. Let's go to the left. Game over. Okay. I haven't saved in a long ass time. I'm oh. Back. I don't even want to know what happened there. Speaking of which, let's freaking save. Uh. There we go. So. So this freezer, do it doesn't open. I can't get in while the door's closed. Oh my god. Okay, that's all we had to do. Anything in here useful for us? Hanging meat. That thing's probably heavier than I am. Raw meat isn't my thing anyway. Okay. Freezer. What the hell? Gosh, this is beyond words. We got a leg. We got a leg. If I want the leg, I'm gonna have to cut it off. Wow, we're going to use the axe again. The axe is. I could is... hurt myself. Shh. The axe is used on a lot of puzzles. All right, we got Great. a left now egg. Now I've got a severed uh, left leg. leg. Brother. Oh. Okay, so. We just need a right leg. We're obviously constructing a body. You know, this reminds me of Downfall. It reminds me of Downfall. It reminds me of Dead Space. And it reminds me of Don't Escape 3. Cause I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure, here's my prediction. We caused whatever problem there is here. I think we're Sarah. Cause we haven't figured out who we are or anything. Um, all right, cool. It would make sense that we're the professor or whatever that he's talking about Arthur is in those uh, vlogs. He needs to start a vlog channel on YouTube. I bet they'd be very popular. So we got an explosive. We got so many items. Scalpel, mirror, batteries. I honestly don't know what to do with any of this. I'm gonna try to go through and I guess interact with things I haven't really used yet. So like, I've used both these consoles here. I've used the backup power unit. I used the sequencer. I used this. I haven't used the analyzer. So. Uh, human DNA trace detected in system. Maybe, oh. It's warning this might be dangerous. I'm not sure messing with this is a good idea. Uh, safety override. I'll need something sharper to cut this. Like a scalpel? No problem. All right, please stand by. What? Abort? Wait, what did that do? Okay, I clearly I had to do that. But why? Safety over. Was there something that I needed a safety override for. Was it for this? I can't remember. There was something that Not said working. it. No, it's a power source. Wasn't there something that said? Is it this? It'll only respond to the right. Say, you know, while we're here, do we? Oh my God, we do. Okay, this will help clear up my inventory a little bit. Oh, I've got all the parts. Because the torso had a leg attached to it. Is this Arthur, that guy? This is his body, right? Um. We did it. Look at you and your Shinigami looking ass. Do we cover it up? It's not finished yet. What do we do with it? The bed's kind of occupied already. The body parts seem to fit perfectly into the grooves. Isn't it complete though? Is there something we add to it? Salt. I don't want to get the sheets wet. Well, you put a dead body on it, I think it's gonna get a little wet. What? There's a compartment under the laser unit. Okay. 
right? Yeah. There's a compartment. I know that. Does it? Batteries? That worked. The laser should be powered now. Oh, okay, great. Uh. What? What? Um, do we put something there? It showed... No? We gotta open this box. There's something in it. I'm trying to think of what else. We can use the mirror to reflect it. Oh my god. The laser cut through the seal in the box. I hope it hasn't damaged the contents, whatever they are. What are they? Unsealed box. Where we're going, we don't- we won't need eyes. That's a Back to the Future reference, I guess. This is what we're missing. Now I can make them come to life. Um... Yeah! There, it's complete. Ugh. Nothing's happening. I guess I don't know what I expected. What is this place doing to me? Why did I bring all these body parts here? I don't know. Can we put the blanket on him? There. I guess that seems more respectful. Is that what we use the blanket for? I don't know why I wanted to. I just... It's what you do in a hospital, right? For dead people. So I thought maybe it would activate something. Is it... Does it not activate? That's kind of... It doesn't activate anything. Why do we do that? Are we gonna... Are we gonna come back later and the body's gonna be gone? Okay, we're running out of... ...items. Okay, let's use... Can we use the mirror here? Seems to fit perfectly on there. Okay. Let's use the laser now. What? Um... What we'll opened the door? Did it hit anything? What? The door is closed. Oh, 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 here we go. It's for this. It's welded shut so I can't get through. Okay, we put the explosive here. There. Now if I could find some way to ignite this. You've already, you've already figured it out, Sarah. We've got this. We know what to do. Right, guys? And if somebody in the comments is like, Ooh, I figured that out ten minutes ago. Shut the fuck up! No, you didn't. You either played this before or you saw somebody play it before. Fuck you. I don't know why I got so aggressive there. I just... am anticipating those. The problem with playing old games like this is that a lot of the people that watch it, they've already played it or seen it played before, and so they know all the solutions. What? Why did... What did I do to deserve this? It's some twisted thing. It's covered in the filth. What is this stuff? It's sealed. I can't get through. Okay. I'm sorry. I can't. Okay, what we have left. Um, what? It's a bed with body shape. I don't think I could. Are you not going to comment on the fact that the body's not in there anymore? I'm sorry, what? Those body parts. How did they get in there? Looks like he's a full person again. I can't get inside there. I'm trapped. What? Let's get the video disc. Uh... I can't take it. Can't take what? Where'd the, uh... 
There's something etched in the dirt. Where'd the music go? Do you want to leave? Yes or no? Okay, hang on. Uh, uh, I hate multiple endings because <laughs> I don't know. Uh, yes. And risk spreading the disease. The disease? We'll go with yes. Leave, accept the consequences. What? Okay, let's... Let's watch the video disc. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come on, Arthur. I'm making this recording just in case someone finds it. Not that it'll do any good. I hope someone watches this. I want people to know what happened here. What happened? I found out the commander intercepted my last two reports. I confronted him about it, but he's convinced I'm an agent working for Cyclovir Hypercorp. Who? What? I argued with him, but he thinks he's being generous enough by not just spacing me the moment he found out I was sending reports back. I tried to explain that the company had just asked me to submit observations, but he wasn't having any of it. I suppose I can't really blame him. None of that matters now. I'll be lucky if I'm alive much longer. Dr. Goodman is dead. Sarah found him chewed up in the main ventilation system. Ooh, that's the body we found. Everyone knows it wasn't an accident. We're being killed out here. Inevitably, they turned on me. Trent thinks it all started when I came on board. They've locked me here in the quarantine chamber. I think they're sealing off the vent room. I'm not sure what they think that will achieve. I don't know what's going on here. I'm scared and alone. I don't know if one of them is a murderer or if that damned artifact is responsible for all of this. Ah, uh, it's the latter, I think. Either way, I no longer care. I just want to get off this cursed station. I found a way to open the quarantine seal, and I'll be heading for the life pod. I don't know if I'll make it, so I'm leaving this final recording as a record of what happened here. To whoever finds this, good luck. Thanks. So what now? We have a scalpel, an axe, and salt. Oh, wait, he went this way. There's a trail of blood. Let's follow him. He went into the vent. That rhymed. It's so loud. Oh. There's something about this that, like, it looks like an edutainment game. I don't know what to say. I don't know how to phrase it. But anyway, this is the white chamber, I'm guessing, and this is the artifact. So this is it. This is the artifact. I don't know what to say. Yeah, I don't think there's anything you can say. It's warm and vibrating. It doesn't feel like a machine. That's the body. Equipment. This device is performing a deep structural analysis. Cool. It doesn't seem to be producing any solid results. <laughs> Not working hard enough. His face. Poor guy. What the hell happened to him? Hello, Sarah. I knew it! So, here we are again. The situations are now reversed, it seems. As I recall, last time it was me trapped in there. Hoping for mercy. I cared for you. I fell for your false smiles. And for that, the mess on the floor there is what I've become. Are 
are you beginning to understand now, Sarah? What you did to me? What you did to all of us? The price we paid for your obsession with its power. At least I can say that I did what you failed to. The artifact responded to me. My blood, my hatred, and my desire for retribution activated it. Oh. I unleashed the power you killed for. Oh. <laughs> and now we're both trapped here in this cursed cycle. An eternal nightmare continuing endlessly until you've earned salvation. I stand as your judge, and I have looked into your soul. You were given another chance to perhaps redeem your actions. What? Given this clean slate, did you demonstrate compassion and regret? Or once again, have you just shown a selfish drive towards your goal? While we reach a verdict, you shall remember. Remember what you did to me. Looks like I ripped your face off. What? Hey, it's me. Oh. Oh. It is done. We have come full circle back to where this starts and ends. We have made our decision. All that is left is for you to leave. Now. The life pod in the storeroom has been unseen, and inside you will find our decree. On your way, you shall remember it all. What you did to deserve this. What? <laughs> Goodbye, Sarah. I hope we never have to meet again. I mean, I hope so too, because look at you. All right, I guess I'll leave then. Go up the shaft. Where? Oh. Wait, this is the grinder. Oh. It's a fan. I threw Dr. Goodwin into the fan. I didn't even need to do it, but I felt sure he was on to me. He kept asking the commander to eject the artifact. And so you killed him. Wow, everything's normal. Can't go up the elevator though. Oh. I'm trying to remember where all the bodies were. There's one here, right? Yeah. That's the guy whose head we found. Wow. Okay then. Commander Trend gave me little choice. It was just me, him, and Arthur left at that point. He didn't trust the spy, but he didn't believe he was the killer. I think he saw it in my eyes, so I took his. Wow, she just says it so matter-of-factly, like, yeah, I took his eyes. Yeah, you know, <laughs> as one does. Um, wow, look at this. It's so clean. Yeah, there aren't any bodies in here. But it's still nice to see what it looked like, you know? Okay, so we found two of the bodies. It's, it's wherever we found all the body parts. So here. Oh. Man, she was wrecking these nerds. No. <laughs> Sorry. Dick Lee was the first. He was my research assistant. He thought the artifact was too dangerous for us to work on alone. We were arguing because he wanted a support team. I told him we could handle it. I didn't mean to. I knew they'd never understand. Mm. And finally. Wow. was checking the video logs when I got to him. It was obvious he'd found Dick's body in the nav console by how he was acting. Dick had been in an accident, so I guess this is when things went out of control. I was so trapped. 
All I could think about was the damn artifact. Wow. So we found four. And then this is where the last one was? I think, oh, here's the escape pod. Oh, I guess that was it? Oh. There we go. Did I get all of them? Hmm. Yeah, I guess I did. Oh! The beach! That we saw earlier. So we got away with it? What? I'm, I'm, so, I'm sorry, what is this? <laughs> what is this League of Legends uh, fan service bullshit right here? <laughs> okay, well that was the White Chamber. Um, that was actually pretty good. Um, I don't like the art style, but I definitely think it's a solid point and click uh, sci-fi horror game. And the fact that it's free is pretty crazy. Um, I mean, it was worked on by a pretty large team, it looks like. I'm surprised it's free. You could sell this. Anyway, um, yeah, good stuff. I mean, the, the story itself, I mean, this, this, if I'm not mistaken, this is pre-Dead Space. So the idea of, like, an artifact influencing somebody on a spaceship, you know, I guess this game did it first. There's another one. Ooh. Thanks for playing. You earned the redemption ending. Try entering the droid code before you have the note. Oh. Okay. What? Okay. I will try that. All right. So if I remember correctly, it's purple, white, yellow, green, blue, red. Oh. Oh, that's weird. Huh. Interesting. So that was what it told me to do on that last screen. Neato. Alright, so that was my playthrough of The White Chamber. Um, I know some people have been requesting it for five or six years now, so hopefully it was worth the wait. Um, yeah, I liked it. Like I said, I think it's a pretty good free horror game, and there's a lot of, uh, work put into it. I can't believe there's animations in it. That's pretty crazy. And, I mean, I don't really have much else to say other than that. Uh, you know, it's, it preceded Dead Space, I think. I think. It was made in 2005? I might be all mixed up on the dates, but it also preceded Don't Escape 3, so... You know, it has a very similar storyline to that game. And, um, I don't know, it's just pretty cool. And that fridge thing. That fridge thing. I've only seen that one other, uh, place, and that's the PT demo, so. Maybe Kojima played it. <laughs> Alright, well, let me know what you guys thought in the comments, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Think critically.